guys welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be on this look that i have here i really don't have much to do but it is my day off and as you guys can see it's super sunny it's beautiful outside i'm gonna go have breakfast with my mom i'm gonna go do some errands i have to do a little bit of shopping and i'm really excited i mean i already have my day off i feel good my makeup looks good so i'm good to go if you guys want to see how i got this look please continue to watch so you guys can see how i got here and please give it a thumbs up and those of you who are new subscribe to my channel those of you who are subscribed thank you so much and yeah let's go ahead and get started start off by using my urban decay naked skin and i've been lately using all my foundations that have spf because it's so hot outside in summer and i'm really trying not to get burnt so i'm just gonna go ahead and apply that everywhere i did already moisturize my face i put my vitamin water spray and i also put my primer on and I'm just kind of going to blend it everywhere and like I said right now since it's summer I haven't really felt like doing like a super full coverage just because it doesn't feel good you know your face to feel like a little cakey and you know being hot and sweating and stuff don't get me wrong if I need to go somewhere like in any event definitely going to go all out but just for the occasion, just going out to eat with my mom for breakfast. I don't really need that much makeup. And just some quick errands I'm going to run. Once I'm done blending that, I'm going to go in with my Shumera. And this one is in, I don't know, it says Tokyo and then it has some writing that I clearly don't understand. I'm just going to keep everything in place. Now I'm going to go under with my concealer. I'm just going to apply a little bit in the bottom. Okay, once it's all just blended in, I'm going to go in again and I'm going to be using my Tarte Loose Powder here and I'm just going to apply it everywhere. I'm going to go in with my Ofra Oil Control with the Dry Beauty Blender, a beauty sponge. And I'm just going to apply it under my eye. Same thing here. Okay. Meanwhile, we let that stay bake a little. I'm going to go ahead and go in with my Sephora Mildly Angled Brush. It's the Petite Contour that I've used in my previous videos. And I'm going to use my Anastasia Contour Kit here. And for me, I'm going to use this color here.
And I try to go up a little like that so that it doesn't look too aimed down. The axis, I'm just going to go ahead and apply it to the sides here. And then I'm just going to place them under my chin here. Okay. Once that is done, I'm going to go ahead and go into my eyebrows. I'm just going to go ahead and brush them away. Before I apply anything on them. And I'm just going to go ahead and color them in. Then I'm going to go ahead and brush them again and just brush this part of the end back and this part at the temp, I'm sorry, at the tip up. Just like that. Perfect. Yeah, they're okay just like that. I'm going to go ahead and use my, Smash, my Smashbox Be Discovered palette. And I'm going to use the clear part here. I know, sad story. That little that little one there is broken but it's okay I can still use it and I'm just gonna place that under my eyebrow here and then all over the lid under my eyebrow all over my lid. I'm going to use my Anastasia Glow Kit here and I'm just going to use the crushed pearl a little bit and place that under my lid here just to make it pop a little more. Perfect. Same thing other side. And I'm just going to do a very subtle eyeshadow. I already did my right eye. I'm just going to do my left eye here. And I'm going to use the same thing, my Smashbox Be Discovered. There's a little brown shimmery color in there that I'm going to be using. I'm just going to apply that over my lid here, create the crease. And it's, you can tell it's really light, really mild. Okay. And lastly, I'm going to go in with another eyeshadow from that same palette. I'm just going to apply that here, a lighter color. And that is pretty much all there. Now what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and put some eyeliner on and for this one I'm going to use my Tarte Tartilla so today I feel like using brown so I'm going to go ahead and use that there whoops I got it on my finger it's all right I love these eyeliners from Tarte they're so pigmented they're a little bit harder to use but I like them.
There's one. Once my eyeliner is done, I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my eyelash curler here. And then I'm just going to go ahead and apply some of my mascara here, Max Lash Volumizing Mascara. Some of my lower lashes here. Want them to stand out more. Perfect. All right, now that that's done, I'm just gonna go ahead and remove all the excess powder. I'm just gonna use this fluffy brush. And then once that is done, I'm going to go in there with this brush here and just kind of blend everything in just a little bit better. And this is just kind of a more hard brush versus the other one's a little more loose versus this one. There we go. Now, what I'm also going to do is I'm going to apply some blush. This is my Too Faced <clears throat> Sweetheart. And I'm going to go ahead and apply with this brush here. And just put it on the apple of my cheeks there. Same thing on this side. Apple of my cheeks. And for my lips, let's see. I want to go ahead and use... My trust fund beauty that I got from Ipsy. It's a neutral color. Okay. And those are that's what it looks like on my lips. Lastly, I'm just going to go ahead and go in with my glow kit here. My little fan brush. And I'm going to use the mimosa color. There. And this is basically the final look. Once again, thank you guys for watching. I hope you like this fast and easy makeup. It really didn't take me that long. It was really minimal effort and I feel good. I'm ready to go ahead and get my day started. I'm just going to do my hair and I'm ready to go. Once again, it gives me a big help if you give me a thumbs up or subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much and I'll see you guys on my next